Hello everyone, in this video of Warcraft 3 Reforged, I'm going to be playing Missile War version 0.67. Much like any custom game in Warcraft 3 Reforged, I don't actually know how this is going to work out, but I have played Missile War before and it's pretty fun. My strategy in this game, I don't actually know if it's that good, because I've probably played this game like a grand total of two times, and I, <laughs> and I think I may have lost both times, but uh, I do know the basics of a strategy anyway. So the gist of this game is that you send your harvester over to these little side regions to gather resources, and you use your builder to build structures that can either make more harvesters, shoot missiles at the enemy ship, and that's about it. Your goal is to destroy the enemy ship, their health is located here. Okay, one person offense, one shield, one tower, C's doing towers, okay. I guess that means I'm offense. I don't I don't actually know what generic offense even means in this context. Uh, so harvesters only cost food, so there's no reason not to just make six of them right away. Uh, let's see what he says offense is. Perhaps he means buying plasma plasma torpedoes, I guess. Also, the second number you see here represents your maximum gold supply. To, base, to boost that, you have to create more energy wells. Oh, maybe he means towers as in, uh, like, anti-missile towers. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so, oh, let's see here. I need to create a specialist. I'll probably hold off on this guy for a second and create the specialist. So I have three in the left, so let me get three on the right. And then create another one and just send him over here. Armament specialist. Okay, so inner shield booster, outer shield booster, uh, rocket fire. Okay, so I can't actually make any rocket launchers because we are in the... Uh, cease fire phase. I think for the first five minutes it's cease fire, so I won't be able to do anything for a little bit here. Uh, looks like we've already had a lever, but in this game specifically, as long as you have two players, you're not at very much of a disadvantage due to how you gather resources. Because uh, with two players, that just means each player gets to get more energy wards. With one player though, now they're actually at a pretty big disadvantage. Hopefully I'll still be able to show off more of this game before they leave, but who knows. Alright, I can now build rocket launchers, so let's get going. Uh, looks like it's not automatic building, so I'll need to create an extra specialist to boost my construction speed in the early game. Yeah. As he said, the shields do look pretty cool in this. They really uh, made these wisps look great relative to their Warcraft 3 models. Ion Cannon. Advanced Structure shoots Plasma Bolts. Mm, for now, I think I'll just make some more Rocket Launchers. Yeah, I mentioned this in one of my other Warcraft 3 Reforged videos, but I think the biggest success of everything I've seen so far is the icons. All of the icons just look fantastic now. Like, Blink looks amazing. The shield here looks amazing. And, yeah. The actual buildings themselves, I think, look pretty comparable, though. Obviously, they look uh, newer, but uh, still fairly similar, whereas the icons just look great. Okay, uh, let me get another two energy wells. Looks like I can't upgrade this to rocket launcher the next level for a little bit. And... okay. So I'm going to send a big burst of rockets. And, yeah. Since this is already <laughs> extremely unfair for purple, I'm not going to worry myself about handicapping uh, because he really doesn't stand a chance anyway. So instead, I'll try to focus on making this a fast game. So what I'm purchasing here is shoot 10 rockets. Once these finish preparing the rockets, it's going to shoot out a ton of them. Which we should be able to see right about now. In Warcraft 3, these actually do look like missiles, but uh, the missiles are so tiny in this one that you can't even tell. 
There we go. So now the outer shield is fairly damaged, and I'll send another wave of rockets here. As long as I keep sending large amounts of those, I should be fairly successful. Okay. Yeah, I can upgrade this to attack producer. Actually, you know what? Maybe these rockets aren't strong enough. It seems like they're only getting through one layer, but then it regenerates too quickly for it to actually penetrate. So I guess we'll stop there, but unfortunately I've already queued these up and I don't really want to go through the effort of canceling them, so oh well. <laughs> Let's upgrade these. Combat training. I don't know if there's too much of a purpose for that since it looks like I'm already one-shotting the energy. Upgrade complete. I could upgrade them to mar Okay, you know what? That's why you get combat training, because then you can get marines. Looks like for a thousand gold, I can get a research that accelerates time, but I think I already have tier two research, because it's already been five minutes, but uh, probably not, I guess, if the researches are showing up here. So what do I build next? I already have a fair amount of rocket launchers. I guess ion cannons. Yeah, maybe I just need bigger, better missiles. Rockets, so let's see, 300 rockets, or rather 325 gold for 10 rockets, so that's doing 1,000 damage for 300. Whereas missiles, you can do 750 for 160. So missiles are a better deal, but you're going to send out missiles a lot slower just due to uh, how much um, a lot less missiles get sent. Um, okay. Let's see here. So now the ion cannon automatically sends out missiles, so I'll just be gradually doing a little more damage to him naturally. And with this, I now have access to Ion Charges and Plasma Bolts. Ion Charges, 800 per bolt, so that's, uh, let's see, 5 times 800, so that's 4,000 damage for 900 gold, that's pretty good. The Plasma Bolts do 2,000 damage for 500 gold, that's pretty comparable here, 2,400. Actually, the Ion Charges are still a better value, and Missiles, we now have... 10 missiles, so 2,500 damage for 630 gold. So it seems like the winner here is definitely the ion charges. But, depending on how the outer shield works, uh, I'm not sure how much numbers matter. Yes, my lord. All right. All work. Off I go, then. What can I build next? Missile jammers, that's being covered by dark green. Laser towers, that's being covered by dark green. So it seems like all there really is to build right now is ion cannons. Doesn't seem like there's too much of a purpose in the rocket launchers, just due to how weak they are. Do I spend 2,000? I think that's a solid no. Let's see here, so I could send four of these with 3,600 gold. Is that worthwhile? Maybe. <laughs> if I wanted to send six, then that would be, what, 5,600 gold? Hmm. Yeah, I should be able to get that in a little bit here. I feel like it would probably make more sense for all of us to go on towers, considering the fact that purple is so low, but oh well. <laughs> Oh wait, did the other guy leave? Is it just me and Dark Green down here? No, he's still here. Okay. Uh, so it looks like Plagueis got the time advancement. Does that apply for my whole team? Yes, my lord. Doesn't seem like it. So with that, I'll have access to the Marines in a second or two here, or well, more like 30 seconds. But. And I'll be able to send out a huge wave of Ion Charges.
Actually, if I really wanted to time this well, what I would do... Okay, so first let me get a sense for how quickly this prepares. Okay, so it seems like that's a pretty comparable rate to the rocket launchers. So what I'm going to do is save up another 3,000 gold, which means I'll need an additional energy well. And then I'm going to shoot out 30 ion charges and then 60 rockets to hopefully double dip and penetrate his ship's shields. Um, do I want marines? Yeah, probably. What you want me to do? Except it's a little inconvenient to what kill them. It? Oh, I guess I can use the builder for that, right? I don't think the marines actually gather much more quickly, so I'll just hold off for a moment so I can do my attack sooner. So what was it? Um, third, 5600 plus 3250, or wait, no. Of times six, eighteen hundred. So that would just be, I'll call it two thousand. So that's like seven thousand six hundred or so. Let's start preparing these. Looks like I missed, and then start preparing these. Are these finishing more quickly? That eh, looks like a yes. All right, let me cancel these and then start them again. I think I just clicked the wrong one. <laughs> okay, whatever. Ah, this is actually, ah, no, this is terrible. Um, hope, I didn't waste too much money there. <laughs> these rockets will now be quite late, but yeah. Okay, here goes the ion shots. Let's see how effective they are. Maybe this wouldn't have worked from the beginning. No, Ion was extremely effective. There we go. So if I had actually timed that, this would have been... It's not terrible. It's not terrible. Okay. Now for the missiles. Or the rockets. Okay, seems like I need more missiles, but their shields are back up, so... Uh, do I hold off, or do I send another round? Okay, I'll try it. Uh, it's not too much. It's only 1,800 gold, so... Okay. But now that I've done a pretty successful first attack, the enemy loses when both of their energy generators die. Okay, you know what? Let's cancel these. Their inner Those are back up. I press escape. Does that auto-do this? Oh, that's much faster. Okay. Looks like he's GGing out, which is quite fair. So, I think... I don't, okay, no, that does automatically in the game. I wasn't sure on that. So that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully, if I do manage to get another Missile War match going, I'll be able to... Well, the enemies won't leave, hopefully. So, let's check out the stats here, and then call, call it there. Units killed, 7. Unit destructors destroyed, 15. Missiles fired, 440. Defense obviously went to the guy who built defense. Launchers went to me because I built launchers. And shields went to the guy who built shields. Ultimately, nothing very surprising here. Uh, I, I won scientist purely because I researched four levels of combat training. And yeah. We should be wrapping up here in a moment. But let me see if there's anything else to show off right before it automatically ends. Yes, my lord. All right. Nope. Okay. Well, that's going to be it for this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.